Question number 11, Melissa Lee. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My question is to the Minister of Education and asks, what recent announcements has the government made about investment in school property? The Honourable Hekia Parata. Tēnākwe, Mr. Speaker. Tēnākwe. Mr. Speaker, this week I was pleased to announce over $30 million towards school redevelopments in Auckland. This means that in the last six months, this government has announced over $268 million of school property redevelopments in Auckland, either underway or approved. We're committed to ensuring that students all over New Zealand can achieve the very best of their potential. And that's why we're addressing the needs of schools with complex property issues, and we're also building new New classrooms to accommodate role growth up and down the country. Supplementary question. Supplementary question, Melissa Lee. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. To the Minister, what priority is the government giving to school property needs? The Honourable Hickey Parata. Mr. Speaker, in this year's budget, Associate Minister Kay and I announced over $880 million Whoa. in new money for school infrastructure. This is more than twice the spend of last year's budget and means the total amount this government will have invested in school infrastructure is over $5 billion, significantly more than any previous government. Fantastic. We inherited a school property portfolio with an average age of 40 years, so have put a huge amount of effort into getting the full picture of the state of the school property portfolio and making plans to address these needs, such as weather light, no, tightness and earthquake strengthening. On top of this, we are also expanding the school network where necessary to accommodate role growth in line with New Zealand's changing population. Supplementary question, David Seymour. Uh, can the minister confirm that Newmarket School's new building is the first four-storey classroom building in an Auckland school will have 11 new learning spaces and a new school hall and is a very welcome addition to the school network in that area by local re residents. The Mr. Honourable Speaker, Parata. I am delighted and fully able to confirm the member's question and it is to the tune of $8.7 million announced on the 18th of July. There are many happy people in Newmarket as there are on this side of the House. Order. Order. <laughs> Point of order. Point of order. Point of order. Yeah, thank Charlie you, Mr. Price. Speaker. I seek leave of the House to um, submit uh, two documents relating to the Northland School Cluster Agreement with uh, Food so, Zero. Order. Order. I just need to be clear. The member seeking leave to table two documents. Yes. I need a brief description and the source of those documents. Uh, they were supplied to New Zealand First confidenti uh, confidentially, <laughs> and. Um, they describe the cluster agreement between the schools and the said company. Easiest ways for the House to decide. I'll put the leave, leave a sort of table, those two documents. Is there any objection? Yep, no, there, is, there is objection. <laughs> Question number 12, 